Slippery Rock University has a truly distinctive name. The university got its name in part from the village and also in part from the nearby creek. It involves a good deal of history, some more than 250 years, starting with George Washington, who in 1753, along with a guide by the name of Christopher Gist, were dispatched by the governor of Virginia to travel to the three French forts in northwestern Pennsylvania. When they came through this area, they crossed what was known as Beaver Creek. Christopher Gist in his journal acknowledged that there were slippery rocks in the creek. 25 years later, Colonel Daniel Broadhead, in an expedition coming out of Fort Pitt, traveled similar Indian trails and his military map acknowledged that there were slippery rocks in the creek and actually by 1778 the name had been changed from Beaver River to Slippery Rock Creek. In 1887, a group of citizens gathered in the local Presbyterian church and talked about the opportunities for advanced education because education in a public form ended in eighth grade at that point in time. When Slippery Rock State Normal School was founded in 1889, it was founded with a purpose and a focus. Even though that's long more than 100 years ago, that focus and the purpose is still there. And it's still there embodied in all that we do. That focus is our students. I think when people look back on in this particular era, they are going to be amazed at not only the construction that took place, but the magnitude of construction and change that is taking place. Uh, I, I've spent a good deal of time, more than 30 years, looking at the past of Slippery Rock. And there's just nothing in our past that compares with our present and, most importantly, our future.